Ooh. What's going on my people man It's your boy Vegas man With all the hype about a brand new Dragon Age game Coming out real soon I decided to say you know what Let me go back to the old Dragon Age joints And let me see how they hold up in today's uh, Structure of video gaming And not only that but like Let's catch up with the story man Before we jump into that new Dragon Age about to drop In the next month or so um, so yeah, this is the first Dragon Age ever released. This is Dragon Age Origins. We ain't gonna get through no servers, bro. Come on, let's be serious. This game is uh, made in two thousand and nine by Bioware, same company that made Mass Effect. A really, really, really good game, actually. I think Mass Effect is probably one of my. One of my favorite games I've played. I'm not gonna lie. That game was super dope. This music is already awesome. Mm -hmm. Alright. Check out these options. Game. Uh, heart. Let's do normal. Like, dude. Quick heal. Use most appropriate poultice. Use weakest poultice. I don't know what that means. Um. How about I just restore the, the restore the defaults, and then I am going to no. Yeah, keep this on normal. Alright, controls. Uh, we'll figure out controls when we get there. Sound effects. Let's do subtitles for everybody so they can follow along. Account stuff. Nah. We good off that. Uh, downloadable content. We can't even see that. Let's just do a new game. Let's go. <laughs> and so is the Golden City Blackened. With each step you take in my hall, marvel at perfection. For it is the fleeting. You have brought sin to heaven and doom upon the world. Canticle of Therenodes 813. The Chantry teaches us that it is the hubris of men which brought the darkspawn into our world. The mages had sought to usurp heaven, but instead, they destroyed it. They were cast out, twisted and cursed by their own corruption. They returned as monsters, the first of the dogs. They became a blight upon the lands, unstoppable and relentless. The dwarven kingdoms were the first to fall, and from the deep roads, the dark spawn drove at us again and again until finally we neared annihilation. Women from every race, warriors and mages, barbarians and kings. The Grey Warden sacrificed everything to stem the tide of darkness and prevail. God. It has been four centuries since that victory, and we have kept our vigil. 
We have watched and waited for the Darkspawn to return. But those who once called us heroes have forgotten. We are few now, and our warnings have been ignored for too long. on the horizon. Maker, help us all. It's like a movie. That was one long intro. Oh, okay. Character creation. Obviously male. Human, elf or dwarf. Now... Human, the most numerous yet the most divided of all the races. Only four times have they ever united under a single cause, the last being centuries ago. Religion and the chantry play a large part in human society. It distinguishes them culturally from elves and dwarves more than anything else. Humans can be warriors, roaches, or mages. Racial benefits, one plus strength, one plus dexterity, one plus magic, one plus cunning. Elf... Once enslaved by humans. Oof. Okay, we'll cut it from there. Dwarf. Originally bound by castle and tradition, the dwarves have been waging a losing war for generations, trying to protect the last stronghold of their once vast underground empire from the dark spawn. Dwarves are very tough and have high resistance to all forms of matter, thus preventing them from becoming mages. One strength, one is in a two constant ten percent chance to resist hostile magic. Let's read out the elf. Once it's said by humans, most elves have all but lost their culture, scrounging in the improvidence living in the slums of human cities. Only the nomadic Dalish tribes still cling to the traditions living by the bow and the rule of their own gods as they roam the ancient forest. Welcome nowhere else. Elves can be warriors, royal mages, to willpower. I feel like I'm a. I feel like I'm an elf. All right. Now what am I? Now these are the warriors. Warriors are powerful fighters focusing on melee and ranged weapons to deal with their foes. They can withstand or deliver a great deal of punishment and have a strong understanding of tactics and strategies. Specialized warriors include Berserker, Templar, Champion, or Reaver. Four strength, three nature, three constitution, a mage. As dangerous as it is potent, magic is a cure for those lacking the will to wield it. Malevolent spirits that wish to enter the world of the living are drawn to mages like beacons because the mages are everyone nearby. Lead lives of isolation locked away from the world. They threaten specialization includes spirit healers, shapeshifter, arcane warrior, and blood mage, magic, willpower, and cunning. Rogues are skilled are adventurers who come from all walks of life. All rogues possess some skill in pick locks, pick locks spot and traps, making them value assets to any party. Tactically, they are not ideal frontline fighters, but if rogues can circle around behind their target, they can stab. Devastating the effect. Rogues specialize in a range. That seems like a me. I feel like a rogue. Okay, Dalish Elf. Proud of your role as one of the few true elves you have always assumed you would spend your life with the tribe until the relic of your people. Okay, what about this one? City elf. You have always lived under this heavy thumb of your human overlords, but when a local lord claiming his privilege with the bride started as your wedding day and simmering racial tension explode in a rain of vengeance. Jesus Christ. I'm a city boy or I'm like a or I'm like a friggin, you know? I feel like I'm a city boy. Darien. That's close. Hmm? <laughs> I'm going to pick this name. Greetings. Thank you. What presets do you guys have? That's a good preset. 
want to pick this guy. Let's change him up a little bit. Uh, uh, this one's good. Nah, I don't want no tattoos on my face. I ain't Gucci man, dog. I don't want no tattoos on my face. Nah, they gotta go with the braiders. Yeah. That one's good. I think that's a good nose is good, mouth is good. Portrait. Portrait is good. I have lost the spell. How do you do? Oops. Where is my head? Greetings. Well, that didn't work. Greetings. Blast it! I have... I lost a spell. I need something new. Move aside, please. <laughs> Greetings. Oh, my spell! My weapon does nothing. Well, I like this voice. He sounds like Trunks. For most players, your party's immune to friendly fire. For RPG veterans, ready for a challenge, friendly fire between members and party inflicts half damage. Friendly, f friendly fire inflicts full damage on your party members. Yeah, yeah, like it should be like that. You know what I'm saying? With a with a friendly fire, like you know what I'm saying? We're gonna do nightmare, bro. Denerim, the largest city and capital of Ferelden. Long ago, the elves lived as slaves to humans, and though they've been free for many generations now. They are far from equals. Mm. Here they live in a walled off community known as the Alienage, working as servants and laborers when they can. Despite these hardships, Denerim's elves are a strong people who take pride in their close community. This is the only world you've ever known until now. Wake up, cousin. Why are you still in bed? It's your big day. Mm. Come on, don't make me use cold water again. You do remember what today is, don't you? No, I don't. Um... No, you idiot. You're getting married today. And Soros, too. That's what? what I came to tell you. Your bride, Nessiara, she's here early. Uh, so, so that means we do it now. I'm not ready. Yeah, I'm not What's ready. It's going to happen anyway. So hold your breath and jump in. There's going to be music, decorations, feasting. Weddings are so much fun. You're so lucky. Uh, yeah, maybe you should be the one getting married. Oh, good time, cousin. This is your day, not mine. All right, I'll stop tormenting you. I should go talk to the other bridesmaids and find my dress. Oh, Soros said that he'll be waiting for you outside. So move it. Okay, so... What is for this foot locker thing? New codex. What is this foot locker thing? Health, poultice, small grease trap, wedding clothes. Okay, cool. Uh, Good morning, my son. It's your big day. Oh, I wish your mother could have been here. Hmm. Yeah, I'll right, say time that. For you to go find Soros. The sooner this wedding starts, the less chance you two have to escape. Oh, one last thing before you go, son. Your martial training, the sword play, 
knives and whatever else your mother trains you in, best not to mention it to your betrothed. Why? Later. Definitely later. <laughs> we don't want to see the troublemakers after all. Adaya made that mistake. Hmm. Mother was a clever rogue. Yes, that she was. Take this. Your mother would have wanted you to have it. It's the very least I can give you as you start your new life. Go on then. I still have some things to do, and Soros is no doubt waiting for you. Okay. My wedding could have been as grand as all this. Whenever I look, I just see the mother. The mother was far more delicate. An explanation of the great tree in the The breeding shows. Oh, there you go again. I, I see Shiani's celebrating already. Hello there. Congratulations on the big day. Have you seen Soros? I'm looking for him. Oh, if you see him, ask him to come by and say hello, will you? Who are you, bro? It isn't my lucky cousin. <laughs> Care to celebrate the end of our independence together? Are you insane? Where would you go? <laughs> Into the woods to live with the Dela shelves? Mm. You're not thrilled? Apparently, your bride's a dream come true. Mine sounds like a dying mouse. Oh, Jesus. I'll spend the next 50 years with a nice girl who hides grain away for the winter. Let's go introduce you to your dreamy betrothed before you say I do. Nervous? Nervous, um... One minute, it's a simple ceremony. The next, it's a double wedding spectacle. Well, let's get this over with. Hurry up. Waiting around won't make it any easier. Hurry up. Where's Waiting the around won't make you it any easier. You should thank the maker for your good fortune. Me. Stop, please. What the heck? Party, isn't it? Grab a whore and have a good time. Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ, he's rude. Savor the hunt, boys. Take this little elven wench here. So young and vulnerable. Wow. Got you, you pig. Oof. Please, my lord. We're celebrating weddings here. Silence, worm. Ooh. I know what you're thinking, but maybe we shouldn't get involved. Fine, but let's try to be diplomatic, shall we? Diplomatic? The two grooms come to welcome me personally. <laughs> That Vaughn? Ha! Do you have any idea who I am? A piece of shit, that's who you are. Ooh, got him. Are you insane? This is Vaughn Orion, the Olive Denner son. What? 
Oh, Maker. Yeah, that's facts. You've a lot of nerve, Night Beers. This will go badly for you. Oh, I really messed up this time. Nah, you did good, girl. He'll be all right. He won't tell anyone an elven woman took him down. I, I hope so. I should get cleaned up. Is everybody else all right? I think we're just shaken. What was that about? <laughs> Looks like the Arl's son started drinking too early. Um, well, let's not let this ruin the day. Uh, uh, this is Valora, my betrothed. Pleased to meet you. <coughs> Soros has said so much of you. <laughs> Some even positive. Mm -mm. <laughs> Don't get me in trouble, Nessiara. We'll leave you two alone now. Well, here we are. Are you nervous? <laughs> I, I'm speechless. I hope I'm worthy of your affection. Come on, cousin. We should have them <coughs> ready. We'll see you two in a bit. Don't disappear on us. Or we'll hunt you down. <laughs> Don't look now, but we have another problem. Another human just walked in. Could be one of Vaughn's or just a random troublemaker. Either way, we need to move him along before someone does something stupid. You really scare me sometimes. <coughs> you know that? I'm <laughs> joking, buddy. Let's just get him out of here. We're all happy for you and Soros. Well, it's the lucky grooms themselves. Hello, Soros. Hello, dear. Now, love, he probably doesn't remember us. Oh, of course. I'm Delwen, and this is Gethon. We were friends of your mother's. We haven't seen much of you since... Well... No, he wouldn't, I suppose. Adaya was beautiful. And full of life. And a bit wild. She wanted you more than anything. It's sad she never got to see you all grown up. We just wanted to see you today and express our good wishes. We've saved a bit of money for this day. We'd... We'd like you to have it. To help start your new life. Make her bless you. Good luck to you today. Good day. I understand congratulations are in order for your impending wedding. I do. I believe, however, that I may have already found what I was seeking. I'm sorry. But I have no intention of leaving. Mm -hmm. And I refuse yet again. Now what? Surely it does not escape your notice that I am both armed and armored. Any fight between us would be rather one-sided. I have no intention of leaving, unless you intend to force me to do so. Try not to die. I'll run for help. No need. I am not here to fight you. Still, I find such bravery most impressive. Do you not agree, Valendrian? I would say the world has far more use of those who know how to stay their blades. It's good to see you again, my old friend. It's been far too long. May I present Duncan, head of the Grey Wardens in Ferelden. The uh, Grey Warden? What that Today are a great order of warriors, child. 
sworn to protect our world from the dark spot. But my question remains unanswered. Why are you here, Duncan? The worst has happened. A blight has begun. King Kaelin summons the Grey Wardens to Ostagar to fight the Darkspawn Horde alongside his armies. Yes, I had heard the news. Still, this is an awkward time. There is to be a wedding, too, in fact. So I see. By all means, attend to your ceremonies. My concerns can wait for now. Very well. Uh, children, treat Duncan as my guest. And for the Maker's sake, take your places. Please, do not let me interrupt further. We shall speak more later. Was there something else? By all means. What would you like to know? We dedicate our lives to fighting Darkspawn wherever they appear, doing whatever it takes to stop them. It is our only charge. In fact, some of our greatest heroes have been Elven. The Warden Garahel, he that slew the last Archdemon, was such a one. I could tell you a great deal more about them, but I suspect you've other things to do at the moment. All in good time. I suggest you have your celebration while you can. Mm-mm. Valendrian and I have known each other for almost 20 years. Since the time I tried to recruit your mother, in fact. Hmm? I did. Your mother was a fiery woman. She would have made an excellent Grey Warden. I never made the offer. Melendrian convinced me that it was better for her to remain here with her family. As there was no blight and thus no immediate need for recruits, I deferred to his wishes. But it seems she passed her training on to you. Am I right? I've already heard a great deal about you, if you must know. But we can speak more of this later. You have a wedding to attend. <laughs> oh, Soros. There you are. I was afraid you'd run off. No, I'm here. Fellow groom in tow. Good. I'm so pleased to finally do this. Looks like everyone's ready. Friends and family, today we celebrate not only this joining, but also our bonds of kin and kind. We are a free people. But that was not always so. Andraste, the Maker's prophet, freed us from the bonds of slavery. As our community grows, remember that our strength lies in commitment to tradition and to each other. Thank you, Valandrian. Now let us begin. In the name of the Maker who brought us this world, and in whose name we say the chant of light, I... My lord, this is... Mm -mm. Sorry to interrupt, Mother, but uh, <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm having a party. And uh, we're dreadfully short of female guests. <laughs> Milord, this is a wedding! <laughs> if you want to dress up your pets and have tea parties, that's your business. But don't pretend this is a proper wedding. Now, ah, we're here for a good time, aren't we, boys? <laughs> Just a good time with the ladies, that's all! <laughs> Let's take those two, the uh, one in the tight dress, and where's the bitch that bottled me? Mm -mm. Over here, Lord Vaughan! Let me go, you stuffed shirt, son of a... Oh, I'll enjoy taming her. And see the pretty bride. What do we do? Mm. Ah, yes. The uppity runt that thinks he's worthy of speaking to me. Don't worry. I'll return whatever's left in time for the honeymoon. 
I live in fear. Back to the palace, boys. <laughs> Ooh. Can you hear me, cousin? Are you all right? Shiani, Nessiara, Valora, and the rest of the women in the wedding party back to the palace. The elder is talking to Duncan, that Grey Warden. Everyone is getting upset. <laughs> Me neither. We should see if we can help. They're by the tree. Get me off of this shit, man. You go get those girls. I'm behind you. You're drunk. Please, all of you, listen. I know you are upset and with good reason, but there is nothing we can do right now. He's right. Running after them will just make matters worse. So we do nothing. They took my sister. Mm. Normally, I'd counsel patients. Unfortunately, stories about the Arl's son and his appetites are most disturbing. But what can we do? We're talking about the Arl's palace. Even with the Arl and his knights gone, it'll be guarded. Elder, may I offer a suggestion? I work inside the palace. I could sneak one, perhaps two others in through the servant's entrance. Nobody will notice an extra pair of elves looking around. I'm with you, of course. But if we run into trouble, we won't be able to talk our way out of it. For that, you will need weapons. Allow me to offer you my own longsword and bow. A man should be able to defend his loved ones properly. Then your path is set. I pray the Maker looks on it with favor. You're all insane! The guards will burn our homes down around us! Enough, Elva. You've had your say. They shall try. For their own honor and the honor of the women. We must trust in the Maker. I'll make sure the way is clear. When you're ready, meet me at the alienage gate. You made it. I sent word ahead to get the servant's entrance unlocked. Are you ready to go? Yes, Take let's go. Weapons and follow closely. Try to look natural. Right. Can I get you a 
ladder so you can get off my back? Got it. I'll get on it. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Got it. Now is better than later. All right, all right. How about you? Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Now is better than later. Got it. I'll get on it. All right, all right. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Now is better than later. Got it. Now is better than later. I'll get on it. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? All right, all right. Now is better than later. Got it. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? I'll get on it. All right, all right. Got it. Now is better than later. All right, all right. That's right. Come on. I'll get on it. Now is better than later. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Got it. I'll get on it. All right, all right. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Oh my God. How am I not beating up this guy, bro? Got it. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? All right, all right. I'll get on it. Now is better than later. Got it. All right, all right. Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Ah! I'll get on it. Come on! Bust his ass. You you have enough. You have earned enough experience to gain a level. Okay, so. Alright, so we got one skill point. Um Combat tactics, combat training. Let's do that. Um, let's do that. Yes, yes, yes. Ice cream is so good. Open the spells. You should try to be quiet. Ooh. Ooh, dogs and shit. Got it. 
Jesus, I died again. I'm out of here, bro. I'm gonna have to change the difficulty for the next round, but yeah, that's it for me, man. Origins. We're gonna continue playing tomorrow. I am falling asleep, but thank you for passing by. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all that good hood ish, man. If there's a game you want me to play, let me know in the comments. Leave a comment in the comment box, and we're gonna do what we do. You heard me, man? Have a blessed day, man. Have a blessed night, whatever it is, wherever you at. I'm out of here. Peace.